Hello everyone, this is Boom Badger, and we will be continuing onwards with Evo Search for Eden. <coughs> now as you see, we're in a different area from one where we last left off, and that is because I decided I wanted to do some grinding, and I finally figured out how to evolve. I had actually looked this up since the game never explained it. They just said what each thing does, but not how to actually evolve. But, you spend these evolution points, and I'll show you in a second. Anyway, I don't know why I'm explaining it now. Okay. So, to spend your evolution points, as you see I racked up 847, you press, in the emulator, you press space, but on a console, you go into the select. And then you hit evolution, of course. And then you can evolve all these different traits. And I'm going to go ahead and evolve the body first. Let's go with the shell body. The best one. And then you evolve. And now I'm some weird lobster fish. And I should still have another 200 some. And we'll be able to evolve our jaws. So our attack is much higher now. See, now everything is only one hit to kill. Which is very handy, because it's becoming very tedious. And since we were unsure of what to do so far, I'm actually a few levels behind of where I probably should be at, evolution-wise. So I want to go back and grind some more because this level is a little bit ridiculous with the Colacanth, who gets very angry and is very strong. So I'll be back. Okay, I am back and I have harvested a lot more points. We're up to 2012, I think, 2007. So we're going to go ahead and evolve, and now we should be able to get through this with relative ease. We're actually going to increase body size. Let's see what this does. I'm just a bigger one with what looks like a brick wall on my side. Okay. Dorsal fin, be a little faster. And we have a thousand four hundred yet. Let's go with horns. Yeah, I can be a swordfish. I accidentally went out. Oh, I didn't read how much we have left. Um, tail. Let's make it so we can go fast. We have seven left, so we're at the end of our thing. And we probably should get some more Evo points, because it seems that I lose some every time I die. And we do not want to die and lose our progress. I do not want to do that. Ooh, I have 50 health points now. We good. I 
just want to collect some so we're not at a complete loss here. Okay, 87 is good for now. Let's see if we can take on this Colacanth. We probably can. What with the horn and everything. It's certainly still a challenge, I can say that much. Because even if you hit its tail, you still get a hit. There we go. Wow, one health point was not worth all that. But now that we know we can, everything should be a little bit easier. Okay, okay, okay there. No matter where I go, there's somewhat powerful enemies. I just want passage. and then you can't move and you just keep getting uh, one point taken off like a hundred thousand times. Almost there. Almost there. Of course, there's one of these guys at the back here. that I amazingly dodged. things attack in groups. Granted they take a little bit to attack, but it's just mercy. Because they all, like, gang rape you. And it's awful. Okay, and now we're in the origin pool? The only reason why I know all this is because I played through this earlier, but everything was an absolute mess, so I didn't save, and just decided to replay through it. I didn't get much past this though, so it's okay. Do that. 
The seedweed whispers to one another, even though I just ate them. Friends, the strolites stro are trying to create a new world using oxygen. They were having trouble because the curlous... Why? Keep interfering with them. Oh boy! My favorite. I, I would just like safe passage, thank you. Can I eat these while I'm... Okay, yeah. So these things hurt and are very fast. Two things I really don't like. Right there, come on, okay. Oof. Goodness. S go away. Stroll lights whisper to one another. If we could move along the bottom of the sea without sticking, we would not have to be ruled by the Sharks, shh, speak quietly or the leader in the cave will hear you. Oh, it's a boss battle. Great. Cool. Oh. Okay. I have legs now. Or no, I still have fins, but... Change of circumstances causes evolution. Mysterious time stream evolves you. I now have legs. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I need to get in the water. I need to get in the water. I don't have lungs. So I guess I have to beat the boss in order to do that. First off, let's see if we can kill one of these sharks. As I press the wrong buttons to attack. Come here. Okay, yeah, we can kill those. Come here. They do 80. Okay, I want this thing dead. Everything needs to calm down for about five seconds, please. Every direction. This is hardly fair at all. This is this is not this is not okay. I need about a five second break here. I need I need seaweed. Please just go away. Go away. I'm dead. I died. This isn't fair. At all. 
because they res everything respawns within like five seconds so no matter what you take out it's going to be there waiting for you right away I have to go through all of that again. Oh, goodness. I really, really hate these things. And I'm sort of upset that they still exist because of that. When they, uh, go rainbow mode like that, that means they're gonna give you, like, triple or quadruple or some ridiculous multiple of the amount of points that they offer. Okay, so these guys give a lot of points. Not, however, give a lot of health. Okay then. I just want peace. I just want peace. That is not something I'm going to gain playing this. By the end of this game, my life will be over. Um, those overwrite that, I believe. I don't know how to go back. Okay, S goes back. So we have that already. Oh, I can't evolve my jaws further. 
because I have the swordfish. The amount of times I've accidentally hit C trying to do an attack is unbelievable. Because there's also D, which is supposed to do an attack, an atta a tackle attack. So I assumed that maybe, you know, it would be, since the fins are called tackle fins, I'd be able to maybe spear things, since I have a swordfish nose, but apparently not. We're actually gonna screw around with this a little bit, since we have so much. Now we can upgrade the jaws. It's a hundred. Great. Okay. We're probably gonna get that quick anyway. I hate them so- ooh, I'm much faster now. Still not fast enough to escape that. So we're gonna go into the boss's cave, see if I can beat them once, and if not, I'm going to end the video there, actually. All the while trying keeping my health up, so when I get in there, I'm not half dead. As you see, this is not gonna work well, because these sharks hold you. And then gang up on you. Actually, everything gangs up on you then. Let me have the seaweed, please. That's all I want. That's all I want. I just want the seaweed. I just want salvation. Let me in, let me in, let me in. This is definitely boss tear. Oh. This is not gonna be fun. Huh, who are you? Knowing this is the domain of the Shark king of the sea, why are you here? Are you not trying to help the Strollites build a new world? The sea's the only world. I will defeat anyone who helps the Strollites. Oh, oh no. I don't like it the least bit. I. That didn't work out. Gaia, babe, please. I can't even further evolve most of my stuff. And I have to go through all of that again. <sighs> I'm going to be ending this episode here. Expect the whole next episode of me just raging at a single shark. The first boss battle. This game is stupidly difficult. Like, it doesn't seem that difficult, but the hitboxes and everything combined and just, like, the complete and utter BS that is the sharks, they hold you still, and then everyone beats down on you, 
and there's trilobites turning into basketballs and flinging them across the ocean floor. There's spears. I forget what the actual animal's name is, but it's shooting up. One pretty much rocketed out of the game and then killed me anyway. Or hit me. Like and favorite if you enjoyed this video. I'm not enjoying it anymore. No, I'm kidding. Like and favorite if you enjoyed, and thank you for watching. It's really helpful.